Yo, 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 guys. Yoshi's back today with another episode. Road to Croix, episode 13. You know the vibes. As you can see in the title, we spam some of these 80 plus upgrades. You're going to see what we get. Let me know if you got anything good from these. Um, and also, you're going to see we sold like the entire club. Everything that you could imagine in the club was going to be sold badges, kits. Everything, everything, everything. We were gutting the whole club. We were trying to get the coins so that we could get Mbappe into the team to try him. Also, you're going to see here, showing you my transfer list a little bit. We accidentally opened one of our Team of the Week packs um, when we were spamming A to uh, open packs. And it happened to be one of the first ones. We packed Rafael Leo out of it, though. So, I mean, that gave us a smooth, I think, 100k. I think it showed 97. So, that wasn't bad. Um... We were planning on saving all of our informs, even the ones that were like discard, because if an SVC ever comes out that requires them, the prices will go all the way up. But we wanted to get Mbappe, so we kind of gutted a lot of the club. That way we could free up some coins and buy him. Um, 80 plus upgrades weren't really too, too kind to me. They really weren't. We, we had a couple walkouts, but nothing too crazy. You're going to see we have a little bit of gameplay here as well. And uh, kind of just wanted to keep you guys updated on what's been happening. Uh, it's not too long of an episode today because just, you know, during the week, some of the days, there's the content might not be as much. But we'll see. We got uh, marquee matchups coming up and uh, new promo, new promos coming out. So that promo looks crazy. Uh, hopefully we're able to, we're going to probably save rival rewards for Friday. And hopefully maybe from weekend league we'll pack something crazy because, uh, some of those cards some of those cards are really 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 looking cool we picked a duplicate kunde which sucked because our other one's already untradeable otherwise that would have been some nice profit if we could have sold the one on our team um but yeah i mean i like i said just wanted to provide you guys with an update showing you guys what's going on in the club and everything like that i'm going to also show you these outside of the foot shots are so 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 busted i don't know if anyone else is having this problem but like Literally, you can just shoot them from anywhere, and it's, in my opinion, it's just getting excessive. I, I, I wonder if they'll ever patch it, but it's it's pretty bad in my opinion. You're going to see um, in this gameplay, we have Vinny, and I was just shooting only outside the foot shots with him just to see what happened, and, and they were just, every single time, was literally going into the goal. Sometimes it was a wide open breakaway. Other times, like top of the 18, somebody with like, you know, I think his finishing was like 70-something maybe, 80, 80, low 80s maybe. And for it to work so consistently, I think it's kind of crazy. I think it's low 80s. Um, even I was using Zaha, stuff like that. It, it, I don't know. I think I think maybe, at least if you have the, the trait or, you know, high curve or something like that, it would make sense as you're going to see free kicks. You know, I told you guys, you want the free kick tutorial? Just let me know. Just let me know. Just let me know. I got you guys with it. Look, again, I'm that guy with the free kicks. Especially with Messi, it's, it's just... It's actually so insanely easy with Messi. It, he spins the ball more than I've... His curve is crazy. His curve is crazy. But as you can see, we're cooking with Dembele as usual. You know how it is. But just... Oh, my God. The, the, the left-footed skill moves this year, I love them. I know there's people that don't like it because it's like you got to get used to it and it's different. But in my opinion, the left-footed skill moves are kind of dope. I, I enjoy using them. Um... I don't know. Maybe it's just an adjustment for some people on that one, but I, I like I like it. I like it. But yeah, I want to show you guys with this Vinny. We literally, every single time, we're doing the exact same shot. And I don't know, if maybe just goalies are really bad. Maybe that's the problem. But you can see here, we didn't really pack anything. Um, kind of sucks. Kind of sucks. But not, not too eventful of packs for the day. Hopefully our pack luck will be better for the weekend, champs, uh, playoffs, and all that stuff. We'll kind of see the vibes. Um, but yeah, also, we were we sold Vinny, and we were selling all of the gold non-rares in our club. And the reason we were doing that is because, like I said, we're trying to get Mbappe. And because of the upgrade packs, they were everything was basically selling for more than its discard price. And since the, our whole club, we had saved up a bunch of stuff... We just started selling everything, and as you saw in that picture, I think we ended up, I think we started this video at around a million coins, and we are ending it at around 1.5, so I mean, that's that's pretty crazy, but yeah, like you're going to see, like, outside the box right there with Vinny, I don't know, I think those shots, 
it's almost like a bailout shot. Like, look, I'm slowing down. It's not really a good angle. I'll set the foot. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But we win that draft. We didn't really pack anything. We're going to have some Mbappe gameplay coming up for this weekend league, rivals, playoffs, all of that. Let me know what you guys want to see. We might drop a tutorial tomorrow regarding free kicks or tactics. So let me know what you'd like. And I hope everyone's staying blessed.